Keeping you up to date around the clock, here's tonight's WIS 7 at 7. The Richland County Sheriff's Department arrested a man who deputies say jumped out of a second story apartment after barricading himself yesterday. This after RCSD responded to a domestic violence call. A Columbia mother is seeking justice for her son who died following a brutal attack that she says was at the hands of several security guards outside a bar in Greenville. One was arrested and charged with third degree assault and battery. Governor Henry McMaster and the South Carolina Department of Veterans Affairs announced a partnership with a nonprofit called Mission Readiness. Their efforts are dedicated to keeping kids in school and out of trouble. Supreme Court justices heard arguments today in a case that challenges the boundaries of the state's congressional map, claiming it discriminates against black voters. Conflict in Israel continues. The death toll of Americans in Israel now at least 22 and is expected to climb. That is according to the State Department. <laughs> House Republicans have selected their nominee for House Speaker. The majority of House Republicans, 113 of them, voted to send Steve Scalise's nomination to the House floor. And the South Carolina State Fair officially open today with all new attractions. The fun runs from today through Sunday, October 22nd. Stay right here with WIS for the latest updates. That's it for tonight's 7 at